I love Columbus, Georgia, Friday night. Headed back to Augusta, got back. Waiting on word about the surgery. And I told this a little bit wrong this morning. I was telling you Friday night, but he actually ended up having the third surgery that Saturday morning. About 9.30 that morning, they took him back in the surgery. And he came out of surgery about 2.30 that afternoon. And when he came out of surgery, he started having seizures. And by 6 o'clock in the evening Saturday, he had had three seizures, back to back. And he, what they were to get him responsive, he, he couldn't talk, couldn't articulate his words. In fact, to this day, he still is not able to talk and articulate like he needs to be able to articulate. But I got word from the doctor. So we're moving him off of the 8th floor to the 10th floor. So because although he can't speak and articulate right right now, all his vital signs tell me he's going to be all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
good about the God that we serve. Yes. Amen. That he is able to be everything yes. that you might need him to be. We can honor a man to Apostle Bruce. Amen. Yes. The man of God himself. We can honor to a man, Lady Bruce. Hallelujah, God. Amen. The wonderful first lady. We give honor to Pastor, Amen. John. Amen. Let's see your back up. I thought she would see your back up. Tell me, money. We give honor, Amen, uh, to all of, Amen, to Apostle Butler, Amen. We give honor, Amen, to all of these, Amen, great, Amen, clergy and ministers on the on the pulpit roster today. We certainly give honor, Amen, to those who may be seated outside, Amen, right now. We honor you wherever you might be. We give honor, Amen, to our friend, my brother, Amen, in the Lord, Pastor Christopher McBride. Amen. First lady, Susan McBride. Hallelujah, and we certainly give honor, amen, to the New Living Way Church family, amen. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. They are so supportive, amen, amen, of me, and we just thank God for them being on our side today, amen. But I would be remiss if I did not give honor to, amen, one of the greatest church. You know what I said, one of? That gives you room for yours. Come on, somebody, up in here, man. But I give honor, amen, to one of the greatest churches on this side of heaven, Riverside Christian Worship Center. Amen to my oldest daughter. Amen. Being here. Amen. Almost can't preach with my daughter. He said not that far. Amen. Uh, I got to know who on my side. Amen. We give honor, amen, to hallelujah to God, amen. The lady who makes me better. Amen. The first lady of Riverside Christian Worship Center. Honor to her, amen. I thank God for my two great musicians over here, amen. Now y'all might go here and all of them dance. That's what they're gonna do, amen. If you give them a moment or two, they're gonna get up and they're gonna dance. And the reason they're gonna dance is because we're gonna let them dance. Come on, somebody up here. And if I was to tell you, like my mother in law used to say, when I think of the goodness of Jesus, and I thought I'd get some help right there. When I think of the goodness of Jesus, and all he's done for me, my soul cries out for you. In other words, it'll make you dance too. When you think of how good God is, it'll make you want to dance. They even dance till you got naked. Come on, somebody up here. When I say naked, I'm talking about butt naked, amen. He got 